friends good morning we're doing a study day in the life of a phd student that's always traveling around and today guess where we've woken up london we've woken up in london it's currently eight in the morning okay so i'm gonna start the day by going to the gym look at my new trainers So I've ended my gym session with a walk, a power walk. I love London. Stop by at the nearest coffee shop so that we can do some work. So now I'm gonna quickly get ready and get dressed and shower because we're gonna go and see my new friend Nora. And you know that on this channel we love to explore different worlds, different careers, different realms and we're going to be talking to Nora all about her journey and her role as an engineer. As I just want to know how did she even get into it? Does she like her job? I want to find out all the juice and the tea. In case any of you on this channel want to become engineers because of that I'm going to be your big sister and I'm going to go and explore what's happening in the world of engineering. Friends I'm dressed and ready to go and meet Nora and I'm in the car and just cracking on with some of the uni reading but i just wanted to say a massive thank you to our friends at the this is engineering campaign because this video is in collaboration with them so check out their socials for inspiration as to what engineering does and their website for tips and tricks and advice on how to get there hey guys i've arrived to meet nora and i want you to see the beautiful view that we've got right here this is the london eye this is the london eye and if this is where Nora's offices are based, it means that she's looking at the London Eye every day inside the building. I'm now with Nora. I'm Nora and I'm a hardware engineer. Um, I do think that's the coolest form of engineering, but we can go into a debate about this. Um, and basically, I work on anything from small electronic devices to big electrical installations with solar PV and uh, home EV chargers for a company called Powerverse and what we really do is we automate your energy, save you money and make sure it's as green as it really can be. How long have you done this for? So this job exactly uh, two years um, but I've been an engineer for a good eight years now. Wow! So I actually work in the coolest location in London. We are based right True. by the London Eye True. in an office called Sustainable Ventures. Yeah. Uh, it's a co-working space so I get to talk to all of the different other companies as well and we can collaborate. Most of the time I'm working from this office mm -hmm. or from the lab space. Oh nice. What sparked that love? What made you think I'm going to become an engineer? I thought well, I want to help people. I want to yeah. be useful. If, if I do a job make it count. Yeah, I thought, okay, well, let's do, uh, I've seen like a robot armed woman. Yeah. That, well, that's super, 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 super wow. cool. And then I also met someone who was doing robotics by mm. absolute chance. Wow. So I was like, oh my God, that is, this is it. perfect. Yeah. I just didn't really know what I'm getting into. I yeah. thought it's gonna be like changing oil in a car or something. Yeah. And it's nothing like that. Yeah. It's a lot more intricate. Every now and then, when I'm like soldering a PCB or something, I'm like, wow, this is my art. Absolutely not just for yes. men. It is so not. Uh, yes. I don't think there's anything manly yeah. about what I do. Yeah. Like, uh, I'm totally qualified. I can do literally yeah. everything the same way, sometimes better yeah. um, than my other colleagues. If I get to hire anyone, I'm really, really, really trying, trying. to, to yeah. put But until there's enough people coming out of uni or any education, so we need I can't you. employ you unless yeah. you start. Yeah. And I guess there's another misconception that I heard that engineers are boring, they're not creative, <laughs> they don't have social skills. <laughs> like, what are your opinions on that? <laughs> yeah. I make so, so many friends from engineering. Yeah. That's such good humor. They're yeah. so clever. Yeah. Uh, and they're so reliable. Yeah. I do find them that it's they're just absolutely yeah. great. The problem solving yeah. is all about creativity. creativity. Do you get to travel much with work? Oh, I do. Do you but, actually? Yeah. yeah. Uh, I think it's, it's your choice. If you want wow. to, you can. If you don't want to, no one's going to force you. Wow. I love it. So, so where did you get to go? What did you get to do? Like, what did you travel for? 
So, one of the coolest places I've been to was Brazil. What? You know, so For so two weeks. Uh, because at the time I was working on a co uh, coffee sorting machine. Oh, nice. I designed a new lighting for it. Wow. So, I was the only person who knew about these wow. upgrades. So, they sent me out there. Do you have to be like really good at maths to get into engineering? What's the deal with maths and engineering yeah no you need to be logical yeah um i think that's an absolute key university is going to teach you everything that you need mm. uh if you're not there with maths yet don't worry They'll about get you it now. You'll get that. so nora's gonna give us a special treat and actually take us down to the lab to see like what she works on and like what she does when she's down there because we're behind the scenes and now we're walking to the lab and we're here okay i'm so excited up, guys we're in the engineering lab. Wow. Right, so I need to danger. But it's all isolated, so I don't need to worry about it. Mm -hmm. and then I'm going to a different screw type again. That actually makes it in the first place. I'm mm -hmm. like, oh, I'll send you I'm like, oh, that's fine. I didn't find out on time. So now I'm like, okay, I can't send it back. I'm not going to waste the money. Let me just fix, fix it. it. I would love to be able to do that. Yay! Got my son, Roger. You did it! Miss you. So, I just asked, okay, what do I need to add or what do I need to change? And here we go. If it comes apart, we good. If it doesn't come apart, then there's still another one. There we go. Got one charger. Right, so they sent me the instructions on what to change, so I'm just going to look at it up and do it. put in the right stuff. Ah, okay, it's actually much larger. I think so. The, no, no. I found two other ones. Wow. It would be very nice if they actually show me where it's from. The signal starts from here, but I can't see on the, like it's not on the top, it mm. goes in the middle. Who does all the labeling? Oh, it's the, the same engineer who does uh, the circuit. Mm -hmm. So the circuit normally starts something like this. Mm -hmm. And then when you use the program to do the layout, you do the labeling at the same time. Mm. There you go, guys. I asked all of your burning questions. So if you're interested, then click the link below in my description box and go and check out the This Is Engineering website because it's going to have lots of information and practical tips and tricks on what subjects you can take, on what careers you can explore within this world and lots of different things. So I'm going to say bye to our wonderful new friend, Nora, who's <laughs> literally busy at work. Um, do you have a last word for any of them? I think you just said, um, come and join me. <laughs> Yeah, absolutely. I, I don't see anything uh, yeah. that I can't do here. I don't see anything here that you can't do. Wow. And I definitely want more friends. So oh, go and join me. Beautiful, yay! Click the link down below. I'm now going to continue my day in London. It's now currently... <laughs> It is now 1 p.m. so it's lunch time. I'm gonna go and grab some lunch and then go and do some studying because the day still goes on but that was really really inspiring to see someone in a job and a career that they love because obviously I haven't yet started my career or my job so who knows what's coming next so it's always really nice to see people who love their job, love their work and even things like choosing like the location and stuff also really really matters so um that was just really great to see. So, I love London. I'd be so happy if I ended up working in London. So, Nora just reignited my um, wish <laughs> to um, work in London. So now let's go and get on the train. <laughs>